Hi, welcome everyone. Today I'm going to show you how to download data from IMF IFS dataset. For that, you need to search international financial statistics and you will find this link. When you open it up, it will show like this. And here, all the relevant indicators uh, sources are here. Here in the data, you will go for international financial statistics where your relevant data will be there. So when you press it, it will open like this and it will take some time to load. In this link, you will go to this button query and it will show you a database here. You can first of all select your country. You can go down and select Pakistan or any other country that you want to select and apply and then find the data. You can find any variable that you want. I want to get data for interest rate. So there are several types of interest rate. So I want to get the data for uh, government securities and bond rate. There are several forms and you need to check which one which one will be available. So I am selecting few of them so that uh, you can see if any one of them exists. So I have selected two of them, medium term bonds and overall bond. And then I will have a look where is the uh, long term bonds so that you can add them as, as a variable also. So let me find it. So I can write it here, bond, bond. So the only bond variables will be here. So medium term, and long term, short term. So I have selected this one. So I will select these. Now in time variable, uh, the best way is to uncheck these and go in the timeline. If you need annual data, you just check the add years and write uh, like 1960 to 2023 and press apply. If the data exists, it will load and show you data in the background. So uh, when I applied the annual data and press apply, one of the variables shown, it, was, it is from 1964. And if I use the cursor at the bar and it is present till uh, 2021. So, and if you want to get, you can get the same data in the quarterly form. You can check this and check that. And you can write it at 1960Q4 to 2023Q4 and press apply and press OK. Now you will see it is from 1976Q1. And, and if you go behind, it is starting from 1964Q1 till present value. So this way you can get the quarterly data. And if you need uh, monthly data, you just press, you have to check month first and then 1960 and you press it here. So it will show you from January 1964. So this way you can get monthly data. So you can make it a panel data by selecting more countries and you can add more variables, but through this, uh, through this uh, sheet, you can, there are several variables that can be used. And when you already have selected, what you can do is you can export it in XLS format. When you press this, it will download the file and you press it open. And you can see the database. And you can see the data. So in this video, we discuss international financial statistics where mostly financial variables are there. And in this IFS database, I hope you understood. And you can use the database to access financial data, mostly like interest rate, exchange rates, money supply for your research. Thank you.